G'day guys, Ben here from Up The Night. Now, what we are going to do today is just have a quick look at these Bradley cheek crests that we've now got up for sale. Now, I've been using these Bradley cheek crests for a couple of years and they're awesome. And I'm gonna show you why they're important. But to do that, I've gotta get a different gun. I'm gonna be back in a minute because this gun doesn't have a big kidney rail on it, so I can't really demonstrate what I wanna do. Actually, I need to use this gun here to show you first, okay. We've got this glass scope. And it sits pretty okay in terms of when I get a good cheek weld here, I've got good eye relief and I've set that up for myself, okay? And that's all cool. That works really, really well. The difference is gonna be when I put on a thermal scope that's got an extended rail and a riser to it. So I'm gonna go and swap these rifles over and then I'm gonna give you an idea and show you what I'm talking about. So what I've got here is my Tika 308 now uh, with a Picatinny rail to native rail um, with my GSCI 675, um, you know, on the extended cheek, on the extended riser rail, okay? And as you can see, there's now a fair distance between where I'm gonna put my cheek and my eye relief. And I don't really like that. You know, you don't have the parallax issues that you do on when you're shooting thermal in terms of a cheek wall, but I really like to be comfortable and I like to get my head in a good position. It gives me a better hold. I don't get a strain in my neck or anything like that. So we've got these Bradley cheek rests. Now this one is already off my 308, so it's pre-adjusted. And it's got these Velcro straps on them. And all we do is slide this on. The first time you do it, it's gonna place it on, but because I've already got the Velcro straps in place for the butt end of the stock. Yeah, I thought I did. Now, I'm going to pull that out. You place it on. I'm going to go with that, okay? Into position. And you secure the Velcro strap. So, this one goes under, this one goes under, this one goes tight. And they sit really well. And now you can see... I'm going to zoom out a little bit here. My cheek is going to be in a much better position in terms of the scope, Okay? If you've got a thermal scope and it sits really high, these are fantastic. You can switch them between different um, uh, rifles and stocks. You can adjust the height, uh, you know, both front and back for each one to get it right for you. Uh, I've adjusted them for different scopes for my, my different my different rifles, um, and they're absolutely fantastic. So we've got a heap of these in stock. I reckon they're the best on the market. I've been using them, as I said, for a number of years. They're very, very well um, constructed and they'll pretty much go on to any you know standard type of uh, stock you know there's some custard moldum stocks out there they might struggle with but any standard you know type of uh, stock you know they're going to work fine um, you know they work on blazers they work on teakers they work on sours they work on all the popular things anyway so um, if you want them guys online ready to ship yeah go order see ya